하면서 진행하도록 하겠습니다. So the Agile Crypto Currency Recession began in 2018. So the overall coin value dramatically dropped by 80%. And you know, the Bitcoin dropped $10,000 to 4000 and just recently got back a little bit about like 5000 right now. But moreover, its hash rate and difficulty had gradually increased and returned to around 6 terahash. So it means that the last miners are coming back to work due to the increase of coin value. So although the cryptocurrency mining has enjoyed several heydays in the past, a significant number of miners are still suffering from the lack of information. So, originally, I'm kind of interested in computer components like the CPU, the GPU, RAM, and so on. So, you know, like setting a proper voltage and the proper setting of over values with the stability test are really indispensable. Yeah, actually, those settings are really crucial for the cryptocurrency mining. Sadly, it is really, really difficult for miners to know the how to know the actual optimal settings and overvalue to maximize the profits since there is no any comparisons. Right? Like solar miners are having scarce samples of proper mining and even huge mining pools have scarce of their standard of mining. They just got this huge like experiences, right? So the reason of the hash power the limit of the temperature for the proper operation for your mining rigs, and the way to create the standard of the mining data is this why the mining comes up. So, what might be makes really so differentiated from the other mining projects? We are coming from this, the three services, which are mining solutions, mining contracts, and mining open market. So it is kind of hard to find any connectivity among them, but now you will see. The first one, the MindB solution, it is basically a data management and analysis tool that processes the data of all miners connected to our mining management partners in order to develop the actual insights. Then how? So as I mentioned above, the V miners are suffering from the lack of proper information. So those users who are using our partner's management, management tool based on the mining, so, mining solutions, we can directly receive the data like a mining capacity, overclock value, GQ temperature, and air currency, and so on. Then we will make it as a big data and analyze it to, in order to provide the user custom and equipment custom data to, make, to enable them to maximize their profits. So, the next one is the mining contracts. I uh, mind the open market, sorry. Um, it will, mind the open market is a marketplace which is similar to Amazon, the UA, and Alibaba. So, it is for pricing the new mining equipment, buying and selling the second hand equipment too. Moreover, it provides a price comparison of all the mining, uh, mining equipment that is connected to our mining my open markets. So you know, it is kind of hard to find new, new mining mix by yourself and find the reasonable prices for a certain quality of the mining equipment. So the flow is like this. So seller registers the products that he or she wants to sell and the buyer will request the product to purchase we're depositing the coin to my new contract, which I'm going to explain it later. Then the seller will dispatch the product to the buyer, and the buyer will confirm the arrival. And those, after those processes, my new contract checks whether the verified wallet address and the pending success confirmation. After that, then complete the payment to the sellers in coins. So the last one is. Binding Contracts is a smart contract controlled payment module that facilitates a P2P, B2B, and B2C trades. The binding contract is used as similar to other payment gateway companies like PayPal, and it is going to be exposed to us as an open API 
So users of any users or any company who wants to apply the mining contracts, then they can easily download it and use it with a low or no fee. If you can see the flow there, then the users can easily deposit and withdraw the coins with the mining contract, and they can enable the transactions between like BTP and BTP, something like that. So, <clears throat> interestingly, MyBee does not operate with three services through our own platform. Instead, they're going to license it to our partners. Then why? The high percentage of blockchain-based projects fail due to the low user uptake. According to the research by ICORating.com, in the third quarter of 2018, like 64% of all projects have failed to fulfill their crowdfunding. So it is understandable that many, many teams expend a huge amount of resources and capital to building a platform and marketing in the hope of attracting more users and establishing a company to support their products. So as a consequence, the teams often become focused on the user acquisition and the ethics pass of fundamental and logistical implementations. So in order to circumvent those issues, uh, might be looking, um, might be licenses those software to our own partners uh, suited to the established in the mining industry. In doing so, MindBee will gain the immediate access to a wide user base and will enjoy the strong support from the launch. As you can see here, the MindBee solution will be licensed to all mining rig management partners and MindBee contracts will be exposed as an open API. However, MindBee open market will be exclusively licensed to our one of the major partners, which is Mining.com. And this is our revenue structure. So we have like three revenue models, which is from the Mining solution is like a premium service fee, and Mining contract is a service fee. It's always going to be a really good one. And the Mining open market, we're going to share the profit with our own partners, Mining.com. So now check out our timeline here. This is our roadmap. In 2017, like experienced members met to form the Mind Me. And in 2018, we successfully developed all the service stacks for the Mind Me. And 2019, we are going to do like all the marketing, global marketing and business marketing to global to global. So also in 2020, it will be dream that we wants to become the leader in the cryptocurrency mining industry. So I, this time I want to share some of the recent trend of the cryptocurrency mining industry, so like how it is going to affect on our mining projects. The so first one, let's see the lead point. Actually, the water power electricity fee in China is kind of lowered down recently, and also, Bitcoin value has shown the upturn in the market. However, there is no further development for the mining equipment like for now. Samsung just stopped developing until like 10 nanometer plastic chips. Although Bitmain uh, released the 7 nanometer assets recently, but we are not expecting the higher possibility of getting higher um, the difficulty of the Bitcoin. And the Ethereum, recently in last March, there was a hard work in Constantinople, so the block rewards was reduced to three to from and from three to two, right? And also there's some further development for the mining equipment, so we're expecting just a little bit of um, increase in the difficulty of the Ethereum mining. And the third one, the Litecoin, recently the Litecoin's value has increased dramatically, right? And also they have a having stages, so the block we are going to reduce into that in the half. And also this is the further development for the mining equipment. But due to those two the possibilities of getting higher the value of the Litecoin, the difficulty at the hash rate will be increased in the future. And that and for the dash, 
the my uh, my and and my are uh, typically is typically in the active way that says and my are that there is and the fusion silicon and seven doesn't advance it recently so we are expecting dash to be the higher and for the last one the Zcash the market condition gets better recently and the iron miner that's what high comfortability in cryptocurrency mining, so we're expecting it to be higher. Like overall, in overall, the cryptocurrency mining market will be not that bad. It's, it's there's a pool of the good news for the cryptocurrency mining industry. So I hope there will be a good effects on the mining too. And thank you for our pitch. Before I finish I want to ask you for one request, which is like this. We are looking for the supporters. There will be some like specs for the supporters, and there will be some limitations for it, but there will be huge benefits by being a supporters, like uploading some comments or the posts, and the, the sharing some news to others, your friends or something. Then we are going to share with those huge benefits. So if you're interested in it, then kindly come to us during our network time and free to talk to our mining members for us. So thank you for listening. And before I finish, um, you okay to okay to not get confused the line, but it will be happening to be such a man. Because you can see how you look at the people from the community. I'm not going to be able to do that. But this is what we are going to do. We are going to be able to do that. We are going to be able to do that. 질문 같은 것들 물어볼 수 있는 그런 시간을 가질 예정이다면 그 이후에 스파크리 마인드에서 준비되신 같이 늘리면서 이제 좋은 시간 보냈다가 들어갈 수 있도록 하겠습니다. 시간은 이제 10시까지 이어질 건데 이제 그리고 준비 시간도 포함되어 있으니까 그리고 천천히 시간 주시면 좋을 것 같아요. 정말 감사합니다.